I let you complicate everything Like puzzle pieces you rearrange I wouldn't change it for anything The way it's pouring but I kinda need the rain There's certain things that I'm letting go Like my old shoes that you threw away Cause I'm so much better with you than alone We're going for broke but I love the change Chinatown, can you see that? I'm so excited, let's go. Day four ended, well, four ended, and we did so much once again. My feet hurt. We did over 20,000 steps. My, wait, we did 24,000, almost 25,000 steps, which is a lot. We did a lot today again. First, we had breakfast, like always, way too early, but it was delicious. I ate less than usual because last, well, Last night, well, yesterday I ate a ton, so I was full in the morning <laughs> when I woke up. Um, what did we do? After breakfast we went to Waterstones, but an, a different one, but that one wasn't as nice. So then we walked to the Piccadilly Waterstones and this time we entered from the actual main entrance because I didn't realize. but. Um, on the second day we entered from like a back entrance so that's why it felt a little underwhelming but today I it's like I saw it in a different light it was so beautiful well so beautiful it's really nice inside especially when you're a bit more familiar with the layout maybe I was too overwhelmed on the second day but I genuinely really love the water stones there yes um, and after that we went upstairs to the fifth floor and had I first had a lemonade and then I had some tea while I read The Portrait of the Young Artist. I still have 15 pages to go and then I'll be done with this book finally. Um, but it was so nice in there and today it was like cloudy and a bit like rainy, not too much, but a little bit rainy the whole day. So sitting inside was fantastic. Also my legs got a bit of a respite, so that's great. 
Um, after that, we went to Chinatown because oh, on our way to uh, Waterstones, we saw that there's a Chinatown in there. So we went to Chinatown. It was so much fun. Um, I also got like a um, turtle red bean filling pastry. It was delicious. And after that, we went back to the hotel and because we were exhausted, we stayed, we read for a bit, just drank some tea. Um, and after that, we went to eat some fish and chips now in the evening and we found like Ollie's, Ollie's, um, it was delicious, the best fish and chip and the people there were so nice. It was, it felt so familiar, like we were regulars and I loved it so much. So if you're in town, definitely recommend. It was so good. The portions were gigantic. Um, the fish was tender and the potatoes were really really good so definitely a really nice meal but right now I am so full so um, I'm waiting to take a shower and then go to my reading first I want to finish this annoying book that I really don't like and then read my fun book because uh, this is like a reward for finishing the other one um, so that was it for today and I'll see you tomorrow bye <laughs>
the trip is done. We are packing our things. Let me show you the place one more time. So like, you walk through here, there's the bathroom. I don't know why it looks like this on camera, but this is the bathroom. It's kind of nice for a uni shower to, uh, for a uni bathroom to have a shower, but then you enter through the door, you have the room, and the view is so nice. That building is so beautiful. I love it so much. This is the view. You don't see it very well because the windows are extremely dirty, but it is raining right now because of course it's raining when we have to leave. Apparently next week it will be like 28 degrees and for the entire week we were here, the maximum was like 17. So, well, maybe 21, still not the best, so. This is the last day, we're gonna take two trains and then the plane, so let's go. Pick a movie, I'll pick you up, we'll go with sushi. Or we'll go downtown, with our best moves we can boogie. So that was it. The last day was just transportation. We took two trains and then there was a plane from Heathrow to Munich and from Munich to Timisoara for me. So it was a really, really long day. Uh, also, when we got to Heathrow, the plane to Munich got delayed so much and I was panicking because I had a very short time to catch my other plane and I wasn't sure if I was gonna catch it. So. I ended up buying four books just in case I get stranded in the airport, but I got them from WH Smith and they were buy one get ha one half off. So I was like, I can't just buy one and then I got two, but I wanted another one. And I was like, I can't buy three. That makes no sense. So I bought four. I got four books, um, but they're nice books at least. I think so. I did read one of them and I really liked. So that was it. Um, <laughs> I did manage to catch my flight. So good job me. And by catch, I mean the other flight got delayed so much as well that I was able to catch it. But it's all good. I got home at midnight and I was so tired. But this entire trip was so exciting and so much fun. And I had a blast. So I'm really, really happy that I went. And this was it. Um, if you liked it, please give it a like. Uh, please comment below anything you want to comment. I will be delighted to hear from you. And please consider subscribing for perhaps more vlogs in the future. Though I must say, filming in public is so embarrassing. Like, so embarrassing. But anyway, this was it. And I'll see you next time, hopefully. So, bye bye. I just give the earth my soul Hear my thoughts bounce off the walls